to input statistics into your Sharp calculator, first of all you need to make sure it's on the correct mode. So you press the Mode button and you choose Stats by pressing the number 1 and SD is the correct mode. It's now in Stat mode and now we're going to start putting the data that's on the left hand side in our table. Because there are 16, the number 16 occurs four times, we type in 16 and we press this button which brings up a comma. So 16 occurs four times and then we hit the M plus button which has a little word underneath data, so we're actually inputting data. And that's data set 1 means we've put one group of data in. Now we keep going, 17 occurs, comma, six times, add it in, 18 occurs eight times, add it in, 19 occurs 15 times, add it in, 20 occurs 23 times, add it in, 21 occurs 14 times, add it in. So I've put six groups of data in, and now I need to access the calculator to find out the information that I want. For example, I might wish to find the mean. The mean is given by the number 4 here. It's just above the, the number 4 button, there is an X bar symbol. So to get the mean, it's a greeny colour, I press alpha, 4, you'll see the symbol X bar turning up at the top, and I press it equals, and that is the mean for my set of data. The standard deviation, which gives us an idea of how things are spread out, is also here, but that's above the 6 button, sigma X. So again, it's a green button, so alpha, sigma X, equals. That's the standard deviation. It tells me how the scores are spread out. Thank you.